of course. Hey Star Wars fans and Black Series action figure collectors, welcome back to another Star Wars The Black Series action figure review. This time we're looking at the newest addition to the gaming great subline. It is the Imperial Rocket Trooper. Now this is more or less a, I'm not even going to say repaint because it's a less paint um, than the Jump Trooper we had um, to go with the Rebels line, but uh, they've decided to give us a different variation of that for the gaming greats based on the appearance in Star Wars Battlefront 2. Um, artwork on the side looks great. <clears throat> gaming greats logo on the front and on that spine there. So yeah, we've pretty much seen this figure before. There's uh, not a lot of difference, but we're gonna crack it open and have a look anyway. Stay tuned. All right, folks, here is the Imperial Rocket Trooper based on its appearance from Star Wars Battlefront 2. And yeah, while this is a complete unpaint <laughs> of uh, the previously released uh, Jet Trooper, it still looks cool. I like it. I'm, I'm, I'm a big sucker for the uh, troops from the games. Um, but yeah, for the most part, it's the same thing. Um, the previous one, his shoulders were yellow. Uh, still had the Empire symbol on it. Um, and did have a yellow stripe there and the teeth on the helmet you know what I mean by the teeth and they were also yellow um, he didn't come with this blaster I've sort of gone to my accessory box and picked that one out but he does come with this with the standard E11 um, this time around he has a white holster you can slot that into the jetpack looks cool I like that this is based off the old Stormtrooper sculpt. Obviously different head, different shoulder armor there, but the rest of it is the same as the standard Imperial Stormtrooper. But yeah, this is a I like I like the design of these helmets. I like I like the look of it. It's sort of a cross between a Stormtrooper and a TIE pilot. I sort of like the uh, the fin slash sort of helmet mohawk. I think that looks great like to see a one all painted in black like a black one of these I think that would look fantastic like a shadow jump trooper I shouldn't give Hasbro any ideas because they'll put one out next week um, <laughs> but yeah no it's a nice looking stormtrooper this is just gonna sort of intermingle with the other ones on my shelf um, but I decided to give him this sort of heavier Heavier Sand Trooper Blaster. It just looks cooler. So again, this is a pretty quick review because there's no real weathering in detail. I've pretty much covered what the jetpack looks like. It does just sort of peg into the back there as well. Um, in terms of the differences, I've sort of covered that. Yeah, I like the design of the helmet. I think it looks cool. It needs some more. Needs some more stands, Hasbro, for some of these figures. Like this guy could be posed up on like the uh, the stand that came with Black Widow. Imagine how cool that would be if he was just sort of hanging up there, like flying. I reckon that would be so good. But as always, I'd love to hear your thoughts. Please drop them in the comments. And uh, if you like this video, please give the video a thumbs up. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. Hit the little notification bell as well, that way you don't miss out on any future videos that come out. But until my next video, Thank you very much for watching. Until my next one, may the force be with you.